Let me show you how to set up appointment slots for virtual office hours. To do this, I'm going to go to my apps and click on calendar. And Google Calendar is a very useful tool. Then I'm going to set up my office hour by clicking on the right time. Okay, so maybe every Wednesday from 12 to 1. Uh, I'm going to add a Google Meet link and click on appointment slots. So appointment slots. Now we have more options and I'll call this office hour. You could add more information like maybe for a specific course if you want to split them up that way. Um, I'm going to make sure that each appointment slot is 15 minutes. You could do shorter ones as well or longer ones. Uh, then I'm going to click on weekly on Wednesday and it's going to populate my entire calendar. Every Wednesday I will have this uh, set of, of uh, open, open slots. Um, and it's very easy to delete all of them at once, so don't worry about that part. Okay, so then we'll add location, Google Meet. Do fill these things out because otherwise students will be confused. And something like, um, please click on save to book an appointment. There we go, some extra instructions. You don't have to add guests because the guests will do that themselves, your, your students. Uh, and we're pretty much ready to go. So we'll click on save and there is our um, office hour in our calendar. Of course, it's hard for the student to access this, right? But there are a couple of ways. So the least, uh, the option that's not as great is that you can actually search for people's calendars, right? So if I search for my colleague, let's say I search for Reginald Weeb, I can see what his calendar looks like now. He doesn't have anything booked this week, but if I go ahead a few weeks, I will be able to see that he does have other things booked. See, there you go. The orange ones means uh, mean that he's busy. And in the same way, your students, if they access their calendar this way, um, they can find your office hour, they can click on it, and they can book something. But that's not a very easy way to do this. There's a much better way to do this. So what I suggest you do is you click here, and you go to the appointment page for this calendar. There it is. Um, by the way, if you have made this office hour a few weeks from now, then uh, and you have nothing else created, then this will show up empty, and there'll be a link further uh, on the bottom that says, uh, you know, skip ahead to the first week where you have an actual appointment. Um, just so you know, so you're not confused. In any case your students can easily access this page. All you do is you just copy the link, right? And then you can put the link wherever you want. You can put it in um, uh, Moodle, for instance. You can email it to your students. And then they can go here and they can just click on the right slot for them. They press save. It's going to send you an email. Uh, and I suspect it'll send a student an email too. It's going to be added to both of your calendars and you're good to go. So I will just cancel that. but. This is the way to book office hour slots uh, using the Google Calendar. Hopefully that helps you out and you find this useful.